Previously on The President's Play. Where on earth are we now, guys? Nowhere, Joe. We're on another planet. Welcome, my presidential pawns, to the beast from beyond, my undisputed magnum opus. Anyways, how in the hell are we supposed to do this Easter egg? I barely remember anything about this map. Don't worry, George. I know all the steps needed to escape this nightmare. We're almost out of this nightmare, guys. Let's finish upgrading our guns and put an end to Willard's plans. Tear them limb from limb! They cannot be allowed to live! I think the mammoths are coming. Here they come. These things are bullet sponges. Shoot them when you can, but be careful because they bleed blue flames that will make it harder to move around safely. We got him, guys. We're finally gonna go home. Guys, we still have our weapons from the film. Let's kill Willard and be done with this. Wait, what? Good idea, George. This fool has outgrown his use. Let's see how he likes a magnum to the kneecaps. Ah! Ah! Now let's get the hell out of here so we can put all this behind us. Wait a minute, Donald. The exits are closed. How in the hell do we get out of here? I have a bad feeling about this, guys. So now what the hell do we do? Willard's dead and we're still stuck here. I'm not sure, Donald. We suffered through so many of his terrible films and we're still stuck here. Seriously, I thought by now I'd be back home to Laura and my paintings. I'm so sick of this shit. Let's start brainstorming. There's got to be some reason we're here and a way out. <laughs> What's so funny, Sleepy Joe? How right you are, Donald. You are here for a reason. What do you mean? Do you know something, Joe? Uh, come to think about it, this whole time Joe has seemed a little off. That's true. Joe has always been a creep, but the whole Samantha situation brought it to a whole nother level. And he seemed much more energized, too. How perceptive of you guys thought you wouldn't notice. Then what is the truth, Joe? Why are we here, and what is your role in it? And why are you always wearing sunglasses, even when the sun isn't out? Guess it's time to tell you all the truth that you all have forgotten. No need for these anymore. <laughs> I grew tired of playing the part of an idiot. Who the hell are you? My true name is incomprehensible to mere mortals like you. But I suppose you may call me Doc Brandon. Where the hell is our Joe, and just how long have you been pulling the strings? Ever since that fool Willard Wyler came to me for help, he sold his soul for fame, which proved useful in creating a way to gather you three here. If you were capable of all of this, then why not just kill us outright? I have my reasons. You three killing that idiot Willard was one. Our contract prevented me from eliminating him myself. What about Joe? Where is he? When exactly did you begin this ruse? I have been with you three ever since the incident at Alcatraz. What are you talking about? We never went to Alcatraz. Donnie's right. I'd remember something like that. How wrong you are, Donald. Allow me to help you remember. Watch and learn the truth. Quiet! You fools will suffer for all eternity! You will pay for not letting me be part of your channel. I love you guys. Now out of the way, time for Sleepy Joe to actually do something useful during an Easter egg. Bill, you want my blood? Take my blood! Ah! Don't tell me another Joe is gonna come out of the fifth cryopod in the lab. Damn it, no, I'm not ready to say goodbye to my friend. Go, Donald. You don't want to die in here with me. Thank you for staying as long as you did. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye, Joe. I love you, brother. I remember everything. Joe, my friend, how dare you make me forget his sacrifice? Was Bill Clinton a part of your plan, too? Are you an agent of the Shadow Man? Bill and the Apothecons were merely pawns. The cycle had to be broken, and they had to be out of the picture as well. So you played both sides to your benefit? What exactly is your goal, you demon? I need someone to collect souls for me. You three have proven yourselves worthy. Bow before your new master. Well, guess we don't have much of a choice. Hold on, Barry, you can't be serious. Oh, I'm dead serious, Donald. Our only choice is to kick his ass. You may try. It will not end with you victorious. Then clearly you haven't been paying attention. We're the presidential zomboys, and we have overcome impossible odds before. Trump actually winning in 2016 is probably the best example. Ha ha, very funny, George. Anyways, let's go, Brandon. Prepare to die. I will consume your souls. Holy shit, look at the size of him. We've taken down bigger, we can do this.
So uh, any bright ideas on how to take him down? I feel like bullets won't be enough. Watch out, he's raising an army of skeletons too. Good thing we got these Venom X's from Beast from Beyond. You have no chance of escaping. Watch out guys, he's dropping a black hole. Lay down on the ground and it'll stop pulling you in. Hey guys, look, standing on this symbol made souls appear out of the ground. If I'm remembering an old Mr. Dalek JD guide correctly, we can shoot them with the entangler at this big bastard. Keep an eye out for his fireball attack. Just how many souls do we have to hit him with? He's one tough bastard. Help me up someone, please, I don't wanna die. Give us a second, Donald. We're pretty preoccupied right now. All right, Donnie, off your ass. He's down. Shoot that glowing spot on his body. That must be a weak point. All right, pretty sure old Mephistopheles here summons a bunch of enemies to try and kill us. Let's huddle together. Let's see you survive this. Really, more cryptids, that's all you got. I wouldn't egg him on, George. I'm sure he's got plenty more tricks up his sleeve. Oh shit, look up, meteors are raining down. Take cover, boys. <laughs> I don't know how much more of this onslaught I can take. Don't give up, Barack. Just remember what this monster did to our friend and your VP. He's gotta pay with his life. Looks like the skies are safe for now. Minus the giant fucking demon flying around. Let's work on another one of these symbols. Oh shit, help! I got you, Donald. Up and at him. Ouch, he got me too. Don't worry, I'll pay it forward, George. On your feet. The end draws near for you three. Take this. Shit, he's sucking us again. Poor choice of words, Barry, but just stay prone. Look, the souls are back out. Shoot them at him. He's down again. Give him a lead shower. Ah! That hurt him. Let's group up. Who knows what he's going to throw at us next? Looks like more cryptids. This demon is dumb as hell if he thinks that'll work this time. Oh, shit, the slasher's back from Rave in the Redwoods. And down he goes, just like last time we dealt with him. Take cover, he's sending in meteors like how the Democrats sent fake votes to the ballot boxes in 2020. Jesus, they just keep coming. All right, we're clear, let's get a move on it, boys, for our friend Joe. I will destroy you all. Take cover, looks like he's about to do a grand slam. Impressive, avoiding that attack. It only delays the inevitable. You and your little posse of bone men have nothing on us. We've defeated a former president working for the Apothecons, killer Kevin Smith, a rodent monarch, giant crab monsters, and countless cryptid beasts. You can't stop us. That's the spirit, George. Let's avenge our friend. Watch out, he's sending down a meteor. That was close, good call out, Donald. Anyways, the souls have been released, let him have it. Got him, get ready to blast the fuck out of him. Shoot his shoulder. All right, move back, guys. He's gonna summon another wave of enemies. But uh, pick me up first. They're coming in harder than the January 6th rioters. Fake news, just keep shooting, George. You will never win this battle. Allow me to reunite you with Biden in death. Watch out, those bitch-ass teleporting kung fu zombies are here. And now they're gone. Made them disappear, just like the Twin Towers. Bush making a 9-11 joke? Never thought I'd see the day. Well, if we don't win, this will be our last day alive. Gotta make fun of myself a bit for once. Give me a hand over here, guys. I don't think so. Oh, shit, he separated us, and I'm down. Don't worry, Don. Us Republicans have each other's backs. Thanks, George. Guess you're not the rhino I thought you were. All right, guys, let's focus and get this next symbol going. Stand on it with me. Are you scared? Do you sense your impending deaths? Don't let him get in your head, guys. The souls are here. You know what to do. All right, George. This isn't Hurricane Katrina. Get off your ass and help us out. Very funny, Donald. I just slipped on a banana peel. I highly doubt there are banana peels just laying around this hellscape. Stop joking around and shoot him right in his big, ugly chest. Enough games. I will destroy everything and everyone you love. You already took my VP. I won't let you hurt anyone else. Seriously, because of you, I'll never be able to enjoy ice cream with my friend. Sure, I made fun of him, but we were friends. 
Who the hell am I supposed to run against in 2024 now? Kamala Harris, I want a challenge. Don't worry, you won't live to run again. Oh shit, Rhino, spread out. George, we'll get you up after we take these bastards out. Just keep spraying Obama. Thanks again, Donald. I owe you one. You think he'd stop trying to get us with the meteor shower attack? We know how to avoid them. Maybe he's got dementia like Joe did. I think I've seen better strategy from those backwater terrorists living in their caves. Mephistopheles is so predictable. Burn like the hottest pits of hell, which will soon swallow your souls. He's really turning up the heat now. Just dodge the flames. Nice pun, George. Anyways, just keep dodging his attacks. We almost have all of the symbols lit up. He's doing another one of those fire tornado attacks. Look out! Dodge that one pretty easily. Of course, I am the best fire tornado dodger of all time. Believe me. Enough with the bragging, Donald. Just focus your fire at him. Damn, Obama, nice shot. You hit him with the same precision you used to bomb Middle Eastern civvies. He's down again. Hit the tiny symbol on his chest. Clearly you are more skilled than I thought, but even you cannot survive my full fury. Fuck, he's throwing everything at us. Clowns, cryptids, skeletons, and God knows what else. I'm pretty sure at this stage we gotta just shoot him until all the talismans on the ground rise up and can be activated. Focus fire on him, but watch each other's backs, too. Let's see how they like a taste of my black hole gun. Looks like Big Red and Ugly is charging up a black hole of his own. George's is definitely better. I mean, what kind of black hole can be avoided just by laying on the ground? Weak, moves dark, Brandon. Enough! Take this, Barack! Ah! Barry, are, are you okay? Donald, uh, please, I just had a giant meteor crash on me. But yeah, I'll be fine. Oh, fuck. You're both on the floor. Give me a second, I'll try and clutch up. We can't die here, boys. Off your ass, Barack. Appreciate it, George. You too, Donald, let's go. Eat lead, you motherfucker. Nobody knocks Donald J. Trump down and gets away with it. The slasher's back, and he brought some kung fu zombie friends with him. Stay alert. He's really throwing everything in the kitchen sink at us. Still isn't enough to stop us from avenging Joe. We have to survive for his sake. Your souls will make fine additions to my collection. I don't think Donald has a soul personally, but we're not gonna let you be the one to find out by trying to take it. Ah, oh, shut up, Obama. The talismans are ready. Activate them, quick. Ah, this cannot be. Okay, guys, this is it. Give him everything you've got left. This is for Joe and all the other countless lives you've destroyed. He's charging up an attack. I won't go down like this. Prepare to die, presidential zomboys. What's going on? I can't see a thing. I'm not sure. Are we dead? I don't feel dead. The last thing I remember is Mephistopheles charging that giant attack, and then everything went quiet and dark. You were too weak to stop me. Too weak to avenge your dear President Biden. No, th that's not possible. We couldn't have failed. You never had any chance of beating me. Now your souls will remain here for all eternity. Nuh-uh, that isn't gonna fly with the Donald. I am not spending the rest of time shrouded in this perpetual darkness. I'm afraid you haven't much of a choice, Donald. I just feel worse about letting Joe down than anything. His sacrifice really meant nothing. It's okay, guys. All right, Dark Brandon, enough with the mind games. Donald, how could you let your ass get locked up while I was away? How can this be? He should not be here. Hold on a second. I don't think he's messing around. Mef seems genuinely confused. But, but that voice, is, that can only mean one thing. You guys always did underestimate me, especially you, Donald. Enough talk, show yourself. My eyes, it's so bright. Looking for me, you third-rate imposter? Oh my God, Joe. It's been so long. Is it really you? The one and only. How can this be? No matter. You are still powerless in my realm. You know, Corn Pop was a bad dude. But you, uh, you went around pretending to be me. That's a crime that can't go unpunished. Let him have it, Joe. 
with the combined forces of the presidential zomboys, I banish you, demon. No! This cannot be! I'm unstoppable! Ultimate Biden Blast! No! We're finally back in the real world, right? It looks like it. And it seems we're in the Oval Office. What a trip. Joe, we can't thank you enough. It's so good to have you back, buddy. It's good to be back. And hey, Donald, you're back in the Oval Office. Looks like the conspiracy theories your supporters spread about you getting back in here early were true. I'll let that one slide, considering you saved our lives. Joe, we missed you so much. You won't believe what we went through. Willard Wyler trapped us in his movies, and we had to complete the infinite warfare Easter eggs in real life. Really? I always wanted to do those Easter eggs, but uh, safe to say you guys won't be touching that game for a long while. Definitely not. We have so much to catch you up to speed on, though, but we can do that another time. For now, let's celebrate. Anything in the world you want to do, Joe, we're game. Really? Anything? I do got to get back to running the country, so I know just what we should do before that. You name it, Joe, it'll be our treat. Okay, well then. Yep, this is exactly what I expected. Seriously, Sleepy, we offer you anything and you choose ice cream? I mean, I'm a billionaire for crying out loud. No amount of money can compare to the simple joy of Chocolate Chocolate Chip Donald. So what does the future hold for us next, guys? I mean, hopefully no more real world shenanigans, but we can still play some zombies together and do some Easter eggs. I was thinking we could go through the Black Ops one Easter eggs. Haven't done those in a while. Joe, you down? Hell yeah, I am. I've never done those before. It'll be fun. Good, it's decided then. One condition though, Joe, I know they're kind of your thing, but uh, can you take those off? I never want to see you wearing aviators again. All right, we'll do, Barack. Thank you guys for everything and for being such great friends. Here's to a bright tomorrow.